637 new this morning. We're talking about cooling down the car as we deal with more and more hot weather. And as you are driving around, it's likely running down your gas. WCPO 90s reporter Madeline Otley is live in Fort Mitchell has some ways to save us money while trying to keep cool out there, Madeline. Yeah, Adrian, both of those things absolutely essential. Your car can get dangerously hot, which is why you've got to find a way to cool down. But of course, that's going to use up fuel at a time when AAA says nationwide gas prices are up more than 60% than they were a year ago. Uh, the Department of Energy says using your AC is the biggest drain on your gas tank when it comes to hot weather. It can reduce the average car's fuel economy by more than 25%, especially on short trips. Now, opening your windows can have an impact too. That adds wind resistance so your car has to work harder. Now, split speed rather does play a factor. The department says to save gas, you should roll the windows down when you're at slower speeds where there's less resistance. And then when you get on the highway, you'll want to roll them up and use the air conditioning. Hot weather can cause other issues with your car too. A local mechanic tells us in the summer he sees a lot of people coming in with broken ACs, noisy brakes, and tire issues. Tire pressure can increase in hot temperatures. AAA says it's important to keep them at normal pressure because soft tires can generate heat. The air and the tire increase when it's hot and sometimes they don't have a, a good uh, a good tires you know they you know they explode or something. Now, when it comes to cooling down, I've got another quick tip from the Department of Energy for you. They say you don't want to just sit in your car and idle with your AC running if you're trying to cool things down before you actually take off. They say most of these AC systems in your car actually work quicker once you're already moving. So take this, stand outside the car until it's time to go, and then just hop in and get going. It might save you a little bit of money. Live in Fort Mitchell, Madeline Ottilie, WCPO 9 News.